Hey, what's going on? Bowman1951 here. You know, it has been 21 long months since we've been off to the Shriners in Wilmington, Massachusetts for a card show. COVID hit, pandemic, and they just haven't thrown any until now. Rich Altman, the longtime promoter for the show, unfortunately passed away just a few short weeks ago. So what we're gonna do is go out and honor Rich and his wonderful show up at the Shriners. And just go check out all the tables that we can, see some great cards. You know the drill, I love my card shows. Let's go check everything out. We'll see you there. Just realized I forgot to mention the reason I was out filming on my deck was that it was really the first time I was enjoying myself out on it after we took a whole week to rebuild it. Get some footage as I take off for the Shriner show about five miles away from my house. I'm so lucky to have all these just within a few short miles of my location. We're off to Wilmington. If you're a fan of Filmington, this is his stomping grounds and that's where his name comes from. All right, just parked. I have my dealer tag with me. I have about $5,000 worth of stuff over at my buddy Barton Cards table so he hooked me up with a dealer tag we're gonna go in the main door here on the left hand side while I arrived after all these guys were gone this was a list of all the autograph signings for the two days JSA was still out in the lobby authenticating some things. Let's get our first sounds of the inside. Smitty, you gotta start bringing that to the show, man. Oh, that in, yeah. that uh, case? Uh, that's it. Let's get, oh. yeah. I have a show in Cambridge, Amaya Bros Comics. All right. He was right telling on. me about you. Yeah. Right? I just, um, I just got his Gem Rippers here in up in uh, uh, Beverly, from, Mass. Yeah, yeah. I just opened his shop yeah. last week. 284 Cabot Street, right downtown Beverly. Come check us out. No, Sundays, two, two TVs, two NFL games, too. Once the oh, season I love it. How much is that for the pie? Number slash 135. That's how I find it. So that's definitely going to be a cool piece for you. Found Steve's table over at SMR. Still not sure where he is right now. He was at our last show in August. Remember seeing this bad boy. I don't know if he's got his Giannis one of one with him or not. He loves his vintage football. Let's go check out this case. Oh, Jordan rookie. There's the Anta Kukupo. Boom. And these are some of my favorites too. What do you say for both? I have never seen one of these before. Um, That's yeah. nice. Smitty said he just picked this up right here. This Mahomes. It is fair. I just needed to. I needed to move some more stuff myself in order to do it. He's still good to the SGC. He sold it. No, he's selling it to me. He sold the SGC. Did he? Yeah. You know what I just realized? Is this wrong? It says 2016. So it was in 2016 Select. It's the XRC. So like oh. we get the redemption in 2016. Okay. It's like the like a scratch off code, and then they sent those in the mail. Got you. Boom. Yeah. 
How much is your Ray Allen refractor? Uh, that, that one I'm asking 200. How much? 200. Plus, I want to do it. It's off 499. Yeah, I just bought the Paul Pierce. Oh, the 10. The other day. The 10 just did uh, like 495 cool. in auction. Yeah. What's going down over so, here? Yeah, I'm gonna call you right back, buddy. <laughs> is it you? No. It's oh. Not, but he doesn't play. Oh, yeah, yeah, duh. We were talking about. <laughs> I'm tripping. It's going on. It's Johnny. the mask. <laughs> right, right. Last minute. What does that say, Nicky Mantle? Huh? Minicious. No, something said Mantle. That's what I'm saying. Mr. Dub. Looks like you've pared down a little bit <laughs> since day one. Yeah. So, so you just private messaged me, uh, what you pick up, a Herbert, right? Let me take a look at that. Trade or? I bought it. Figured I did well enough today that I can afford to buy something nice. Mm -hmm. All those uh, Trevor Lawrence boxes gone, they are not. All right, let's hit up some tables of some guys I don't know who are about to tear down for the day. Beautiful vintage hockey. All graded. Prices too. At the same booth, got a lot of vintage basketball, 61 clear. Oh. I got a lot of friends after that just speaker there. It's be pretty good shape. This probably has some, uh, some creases on it. Nice line of seven tops here. All stars. Second year, Reggie. All right, show's winding down. We're gonna head on over to Barton's Cards where a lot of my stuff is. Kind of check in with him, see how the show went because it's two hours from closing for the weekend. Barton, let's see a deal go down here, man. Hey, Come on. what's going on? You gotta close it out. I'm trying, my friend, I'm trying. This guy's really easy to take advantage of. That's true, what's that going for? Deal? What do we got there, dude? Okay. He Let's owed see me it. some money for some deal that we did before. He worked his butt off this weekend, and this is gonna clear it. I'll do that if you want to. Okay, cool. Okay.
tickets. Part of your case. <laughs> Loving that Tatis. Oh, uh, the, the wave? Yeah. I pulled that. No way. Yeah, I pulled that out of a. Um, like in 19 or just recently? In 19. Like okay. when a product just came out. Uh huh. Wow. And you still have it. That's great. Yeah. So this is Jess. Uh, just ran into his table and he remembered me from the Teeny Garden show and hooked me up with a little gift 51 Bowman Jim Persall. Rookie, rookie card, right? Yeah, the yeah. Red Sox. Yeah. I'm having a hard time focusing here, but it is a PSA 5. So definitely be adding this as set registry. I really appreciate you uh, no coming to see me, and I'm hoping you set up at one of my future shows. Okay, well, we'll see yeah. you then. Thanks. Thanks, Jess. Let's take a look at I some of Jess's. Up, I, just, uh, I just picked up a 52 trades, I believe. Jackie, and I traded these two for the 52 Jackie. PSA okay. Three. Okay. We'll take a look at the OC here. I know. It's a little top to bottom. Nothing yep. crazy. It's pretty. Yeah, it's packed. Right. I mean, the surface is great. Mikey B. Yeah, you were hit. You should have been here. I with know. My back. I know. I sold so much wax. At it's least, not even funny. Hey, at least you're still here. Almost hey. everybody else is uh, shutting down. Thanks again, sir. Hi. It's fifteen, so it'd be seven dollars. How was your weekend? Awesome. Awesome. Good to hear. Six. Okay. You know, it's so much fun to run in all your dealers here. I've been talking to a bunch of them. A couple guys I want to have at a future show. This is great. Realize the traffic's down. An hour to go for the show, but just the camaraderie with all my car guys. Nothing beats it. I'm trying to figure this out. Are you the beer distributor dealer too? wish no no oh i thought all of this was for sale that's funny it is it's all for sale oh i just can't sell any beer okay yeah i'd say so very nice the big robert williams fans no what are these number two i could sort of see it there that's at a 99 99 yep 49 those are the classic National Treasured RPAs. Oh, uh, I wish I had the cash to pick up that Jeter off from you. That's a Jeter Gold. Beautiful. Ron rookies, Ken Griffey rookies, Mike Trout rookies. So we're at Rich's old table. His partner ended up bringing out all these cards that were his. Just gonna take a, a nice long look. Take it back At the legacy of Rich Altman and his no, he didn't. his product. We got an HP. Is it HP? He is going to no, okay. There's an HP. Continue his team. He'll be back in April, 2022. 
same location. That's typically when yeah. his show is. It's under the table, maybe? No, I, we use it. Got moved this year because of the pandemic. So there's a cardboard box that went with it. I got some here. Getting into some, some nice baseballs up here. At least yeah, I see the prices on them. Wow. That's not it. It'll be a thinner box. Okay. Got more showcases coming up from Mitch. Unless he brought it back to the table, maybe? <laughs> he might have. Let me ask Rick. Yeah. You're going to use it here, right? Huh? You're going to use it here, right? Yeah, I would assume. Yeah. Uh, you know what? Check out there. The girls might have had one out there. Okay. It's the only place I could that. Say it. So I really appreciate all the info. Not a problem. Good to hear Rich's team is going to be back. Oh, uh, we'll definitely. We'll, we'll see definitely. you in November and April. Yes, sir. All right, thank, thank you. you. Dealers are all heading out. A little early. There they go. Some more. John, I'm, John, I'm putting you on the spot. How'd you do? Three days. Oh, I'm wanted in some states. I did good. That's a real good show. Very good, good solid show. See you in a couple weeks. All right. Oh man, I didn't even make it to your table. I didn't realize you were closing down. Oh yeah. It How is, did uh, things go? I'm KO'd, like exhausted. <laughs> it was sloppy. It was definitely probably the slowest foot traffic show they've had here yeah. in a long time. But I did a couple of bigger deals. That sometimes only takes one or two deals. You know. Right. So, right. Yeah. I heard everybody's disappointed by Saturday and yeah. crowd size. Yeah. It was it was the slowest Saturday I've ever seen here. Oh. Huh. I think there were a lot so of stuff bummer. working against the show. I mean, like they changed the date three or four times. Yeah. You know, unfortunately, Altman passing. Like I'm sure that threw them for a loop. You know. Right. Um, plus, this is the last weekend of the summer. I'm going back to school next week. Kids going back to school. Maybe they do us some last minute family stuff. So yeah, yeah. But um, I think November will be strong. It usually is. Right smack in the middle of football season, you know. Harden's back at it. Quickly to eat. He's sticking around since when? It's Revolution. There's no discount on that because that's literally. I thought it was a Chinese. Game. It's to eight. The only reason it's priced at 200 is because that's what Trevor said to price it at to move it at. I think it's like a thousand. I didn't realize it was SMR and Bob Carter. I'm like, what's going on, Steve? Smitty, ask you some questions. Huh? Yeah. You, how was the show, man? How'd you do? It was good. A little slower than usual Shriners. Yeah, uh, I agree. I think it's because kids are going back to school, parents are focusing on that sort of stuff. I think November's going to be crazy. Flipping card show on the 11th. Be there, be square. It's going to be right. awesome. We're moving in October to the 23rd, by the way. Okay. So we don't run into TD's garden yeah, show. Yeah, perfect. That's perfect. Show. Yeah. Absolutely. All right, man. Appreciate it. We'll appreciate see you in uh, two weeks. Absolutely. I'll be there. All right. Altman Show 2021 in the books. Heard from a few dealers that uh, crowds weren't as great this time around. I can imagine with Rich passing away just a few short weeks ago, that the promotion may have slipped towards the end, but. Also heard that there are no dealer spots left for the, the upcoming um, November show, the GBSCC. Go check that one out. I think it's the first weekend in November, if I'm not mistaken, and that'll be a biggie. So yeah, there's already a waiting list for that one. It should be a much better turnout than this one was, unfortunately, but hey, we got a lot of good footage. Hope people saw a lot of good cards here and we love these. We're always out at them. Come see ours September 11th and October 23rd. Looking to sign a long-term contract after that for the best whipping card show. We'll see you at the next one. Bowman 1951 out.